Hello and welcome back to the Beyond Typus multiplayer with Rumba, Stijo, and Zippy. Say hello, guys. Hello, guys. Hi, hey, he said it. What's going on? He said it. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm in a good mood today. I've yeah. had lots of caffeine. That's Wait, good. We should, we, should, we should probably not pause, unpause yet, right? Because this is a first rep episode. Does anyone know what we're doing? I'm going to go murder am... some people. Probably Florence and Venice, judging by the location of my troops. I'm terrified. Okay. I'm I'm absolutely terrified of this massive French army stack that I'm at war with. Yeah, you are the want. one marching into French land. But he's he's not there. Okay, if if I suddenly see him like walking away from Burgundy, then I'm just gonna like hightail it up. Well, I'm I do need I'm, I do need to take like a loan and buy a fort on this province over here. Let me do that right now. I am boosting my corruption so that I get. Boosting uh, lower, your corruption? Yeah, so I get lower national unrest because I've got, uh, huh. I've got rebels. So uh, there's a there's a new feature that you might not be aware of, Stijo. Uh, grab okay. one of your armies and press the R key. That turns on auto suppress, and they suppress in an area now. And when they're on that mode, they suppress five times as strong as normal. What? So, yeah. That's yep. OP. So, so instead of having <laughs> to use 20 troops to reduce five unrest, you can use four. So. You can get max unrest per province from just four regiments. So like wherever you're having issues. Oh god, Ireland's at twenty-four unrest. Jesus. Yeah, I've got lots of lots of issues everywhere. Oh well, that's really cool. Yeah, you should use that. Uh it, it requires you to be at full maintenance of course, but it's pretty good. Yeah, that was really cool. I don't Go remember ahead. anything. I don't remember anything at all about what I was doing last week. Yeah. All I noticed is that I'm I'm giving you I'm tripling your income. Is that like, do I need to keep doing that? <laughs> uh, what are you giving me? Probably. Me well, I mean, I would be four in the hole if you didn't, so. Yeah, I guess I'll keep it going for a while then. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, what was this about England? England was theoretically going to attack somebody and we guaranteed him. Is he? Wales. Yeah, so Wales, um, Wales got broken to rebels. And they became independent, and then England was all like, Yo, Wales, I'm a punch your face in now. And we were like, Nah, fam, that ain't happening. <laughs> Seems reasonable. Yeah. So he, he was just kidding, though, it looks like, because he's not actually attacking. <laughs> I, I think we may have stayed his hand. Okay. They don't normally do that. They don't. They don't like to recalculate. Oh, the Ottomans have declared me as a rival. All right. Easy, huh? Where's France going? Where's where this, where this bastard going? He's in my land right now. He's got 25k moving into Genevoa. Genevoa. He's I'm, got. I'm like. He's got this Allied super defense. general. <laughs> I should oh. be. I should, I should be rooting for France here. Oh, holy hell you. I'm also rooting for France because I would like him to be my ally again. But I can't unless he gets unexcommunicated. Oh, right. It broke your alliance against that, your will or something. Yeah, because I don't like him enough anymore. Wait, I thought Offaly was already... They're already Protestant. I don't care if they get less missionary strength. Commit <laughs> the unrest down. Oh, that's right. We're Protestant. Yeah. yeah, I'm the defender of the faith. Yeah. <laughs> I, just, like, there's so many things that I'm like re relearning that I don't remember from the campaign last Your week. Your memory is worse than mine. Well, I've, I've played a campaign or two since then. Um, my country is a sham. It's just a shamble of territory. Oh, oh it's, come it's, on. It's really Everyone hideous. knows that your country is easily the strongest out of a lot of us. No, oh, did you look how fragmented and weak I am? Oh, fragmented and strong. <laughs> did I what? <laughs> did you want these bolts, mate? Oh yeah, I wanted transports. I remember that was an issue. I couldn't buy transports, and I oh, gave no. you money. So you, yeah, so you're supposed yep. to just sell them to me for zero ducats, right? I already pre prepaid you, I thought. Yeah, they're you're all like... they're all popping out now. Eh, uh, what are you? Oh, where'd all these troops come from? I can sell bolts. Oh shit, I should probably put them all in their fleet, shouldn't I? Okay, it looks like my allies in this war aren't as weak as I thought they were. 
damn it! I just lost the claim I was about to declare for. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Didn't that happen like, the last like time we months. started a new session as well? You lost like a bunch of claims all on the first day. Yeah, yeah you lost like, all of them. Yeah. All of them. Yeah, they all expired. So, okay, I think I need to cancel autonomous rebel suppression. Until you go and punch them in the face. It's admirable what Bremen and Liège are doing, but they're going to die now. Oh god, that's actually a lot more men than I thought there was going to be. Yeah. And his army's a little split up right now. Ooh. I should probably take advantage of this. Oh, am I going to win this? I should win this. Yeah. No aggressive expansion. Why am I not attacking more? Because you're feigning weakness. Oh, oh yeah, we're waiting on the that makes sense. sense. Emphasis on oh, the feigning no. part. I, I think most of it was I was trying to help you. I had to get my army up there and that... Yeah, yeah, and then, so and then you were waiting on the bots to send some of them back. That was a very right. painful battle. So, uh, I get the impression you don't really need my military up there anymore. But you could probably benefit from the subsidies and stuff. I'll be around uh, if you need me, but I'm coming. Yeah, I should, I should be fine. I mean, you've got nine bots now, so... Nice. France still has 17 heavies. Thank you. Oh yeah, I remember them being super strong in there. Your sailors Heavy will regard. serve my army well. <laughs> right. Oh well, you got Labord. That's their um, a fort. Oh, I've got, I've got another yeah. thing being made for you. Fort. The fort was important. Forts are always important. I remember last episode, I had like my best general sieging the fort when he died right before a, a massive French army uh, attacked him and sack wiped him. I didn't even know you could get sack wiped with that big of an army. At full morale? Like, holy crap. Did you not watch a rumble marching around stack wiping 80 stacks? <laughs> no. I guess not. I missed it. I don't remember doing that. Did <laughs> I do that? It sounds like something you would do. Definitely sounds like something that you up. would do. No, no, I think I'm pretty sure there's a video of it. Possible. <laughs> Alright, Venice, just give me your shit already. Oh yeah, I forgot Norway got fucking Orkneyge uh, rebels. Yeah, yeah, we tried to stop it and we couldn't quite get them in time or something. Yeah, what happened? Oh, I went bankrupt. I feel like I should yeah. be participating in these fights. I need a... Well, I've got a diplomat. Why can't I... Oh, I need to spy on Denmark to do anything to... Oh, shit. Fucking motherfuckers in Wicklow now. That's alright. I'd rather just put down the fucking rebels via punching them in the face than anything else. Right, I can now study technology. Who is worthy of technology studying? Uh, anyone who has better tech than you. If, if they have like one tech advantage, then they uh, they give you a 5% discount at 100% spy strength. Oh, that's cool. So yeah, like if someone's two techs each ahead of you, like, you know, you're on 11 and they're on 13 in every category, then that's 10% discount if you get your spy network to 100%. Venice just has so many little friends, it's so annoying. And he still has an army? Since fucking when? Oh, I killed that already. I think it's time for me to murder Denmark. That sounds good. That could be fun. Denmark's on tech 10, Sweden's on tech 10, Norway's on tech 10. And I have my, my ridiculous generals. I have a general that is a 6663 with shock damage received minus 10. And I just hired a military advisor, which gives shock damage minus 7.5. So altogether, I have shock damage received minus like 20% nearly. If only I was Spain with the Spanish Tercios. I know, right? Yeah, I think like 50% reduced damage. So where are the fucking study technology? Well, if you stack them, I meant. Oh, yeah. Uh, Study technology is automatic. Uh, you just have to spy on yeah. someone who has more tech than you. Oh, okay. Oh, well, that's fine. 
Don't mind me. Just took a bunch of territory off Venice. Oh, I see. Oh. Do they even have Venice anymore? No. Oh. They didn't deserve it. I don't really know what France is doing right now. They must have lost a battle at some point. Oh, really? Oh. This guy moves so quickly. I found that movement speed in the in Italy is insane. Those oh, little yeah. tiny provinces, like it takes one day to move between every province. Crazy. Yeah, it's also hard to click on some of them. Very difficult. Yes, they they're like in the wrong spot practically. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Especially well, moving moving around um, like the north part of the Papal State right now, like the arrows don't point to where they're actually moving to. Which is quite irritating. I want to try to bait France into trying to siege this fort back. I might not need to. I'm sorry if you can hear my kid in the background. My wife's got him in the bedroom to keep him away. Oh, sorry. Because he, uh, I, I mean, me. it's it's half past ten and he's still not asleep. Maybe he's well, just well, as Just tie the motherfucker down. <laughs> I'm getting the impression he wants to be awake. Like... Yeah, that it certainly sounds that way. You need to reason with him. And if that doesn't work, club. Chloroform. Chloroform. Exactly. Chloroform also works and is probably less likely to cause brain damage than a club. <laughs> but I mean, each have their benefits. I'm sure. Steve, Here we go. I you're pick the up only more one of us that isn't at war. You want to you wanna maybe uh, change that? I mean, I'm kind of at war. <laughs> With yourself? Oh, rebels. Uh, well, we call them separatists, but yeah. There, I'm gonna build it a supply depot here. No more attrition. There we go. Supply depot. Yeah. I think maneuver pips are a lot more valuable with this mod in Italy than uh, they otherwise would be. Just the ability to catch the little stacks before they run away would be real nice. Oh, looks like France is combining their stacks. I have Parliament. Nice. Well, that's good. Can't remember. Did I go for that? No, it'll be my next one. Although <laughs> I won't be going with the Parliament because I don't like it. Income from vassals plus five percent. <laughs> Dip my annexation minus fifteen. I just don't like oh, the mechanic. Yeah, I, it annoys me. It might really? be. Yeah, I just really, really don't like it. Ever since they had, well, it was Rule Britannia that enabled it, or was it a previous one before that? Shit, let me piece out. No, it was before that. I can't remember which one it was, but yeah, just never enjoyed it. I used to love playing as England, but since they added the parliaments, not a fan. Oh, and also, for the people wondering, um, in the last episode, I was probably sounding really, really terrible. Um, I'm still not 100% and so maybe in the like, you know, next eight episodes, my voice is going to deteriorate again. So another apology for that as well. For some reason I just can't shake sicknesses. It's quite annoying. Because you're a pussy. <sighs> I would be if I wasn't doing this. If I was like, you know, giving up. Oh. No, oh, you can't back out of a war burgundy and then decide, hey, can I have military access? No, no, you can't have it. <laughs> Traitor. I'll give him it. Oh, you're at war, I remember. Yeah, I, oh. I know. Oh, the ship to sell you and everything. <laughs> oh. Yeah, sorry, no, I'm at war. That's right. Gotta fight burgundy, and uh, apparently France just pieced him out, so... Yep. 
Wow. Okay. Sorry about that. Someone subscribed to my Twitch channel. <laughs> loud ass noise. So what's my... So I'm accidentally spying on my own subject. That's smart. <laughs> I was thinking, oh, I should attack that guy. He's in my node. No, he's not in my subject. I remember, Jesus. <laughs> my goodness. Why does it even let me spy on my own subject? How, how the fuck can I make my opinion with someone better? It's an elusive modifier. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can offer your military. If you ask for military access, you still like not fix that, really. Yeah, your opinion of other for fuck's countries sake. is just—it's just silly. Yeah. It's been like that for fucking years, and I remember it pissing me off something rotten back then as well. French attitude towards Milan: friendly, plus seventy-one. My attitude towards them: neutral, negative seventy-one. Well, hold on, do we not control the war goal anymore? Aggressive expansion. Unlawful territory. They are excommunicated. Okay, game, I would appreciate it if you stopped taking my stability. I'm not Lambert. So <laughs> step it's his way, please. Hey, I'm, I'm good with stability right now. I'm a plus one. Yeah, I think I'm going to stay Catholic. Boo. Even though I plan on murdering the Pope, I am going to stay Catholic. This vault, Arumba. Yeah. Again, uh, again. Like look at my forts, my beautiful forts. I'm I'm tempted to go for cavalry. Believe it or not, there's a there's an idea that makes it kind of interesting. It's the uh, the tactical ideas, movement speed, and then cavalry flanking ability plus fifty percent. Like, could actually be good. Yeah. <laughs> believe it or not. But they still like lose oh. the. The cohesion you thing. Well. Also, if you pair that with shock IDs, you get cavalry combat ability plus 7.5%. But yeah, if you want to take shock ideas, I'll take fire ideas and we'll see which one's better. We'll have a like, you assume fight later in the game. Yeah, later in the game, yeah. Oh god, I've got fucking. I've got a rebellion in North Africa that I can't really do anything about right now. Italy versus Germany. Nope, don't get distracted. I turned to look at North Africa, and when I went back, there was a massive French stack, like, just a few provinces away. That's how this game works. They want you to be distracted. So this would give me a coalition. Uh, I'm not worried about literally any of those. That's fine. Actually, if Savoy joins the coalition, I could attack the coalition and not be worrying about Austria. That would be nice. Brandenburg's oh, so doing well. Apart from we the probably, little uh, bit of purple in the middle of them. We noticed the bug. I, I noticed the bug between episodes, or between weeks. Actually, about the aggressive, no, the uh, unjustified demands penalty, remember? Yeah. I never updated that. Uh, no. Uh, I've told the mod dev about it, though, and um, he said thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so not, not, I'll fix it as soon as possible. Just no, no, he, he's on it. He's on it. Don't worry. Florence becomes the uh, vassal of Milan. Peace costs Milan 200 dip. Oof. That's a small price to pay, yeah? You can do it. You can do it. I think what my army would cost is finally me to just enough. take all of his land. 125 dip. Coalition includes Austria, though. Yeah, I'll just I'll pay the 75 to get Austria out of the coalition. Plus all of your money. How, bye bye. How much have you stacked for aggressive expansion impact? Uh, I will tell you in just a moment. Apparently, I just lost I a battle. I'm only at like minus 20, so I can't really go completely crazy. Well, apparently my uh, my air was kind of weak. Negative that's sixty. A, that's another rebellion. Fuck. Oh, no, we're we're good. We're we're good now. I'm at negative sixty. That's a decent amount. You could do a lot with that. How goes your war, Zippy? France is at uh, two war score. They are. That's it. Positive. I wonder two if with, uh, they would like some condottieri. 
Well, fans, uh, well, I can't, I can't piece friends out. I don't know why they're something. Not the war leader. Probably, probably because yeah. you're not the war leader, and I'm not the war leader. They're not the war leader. Yeah. So that's all exactly why. <laughs> For some reason, it? this exact reason. Well, the war itself is at negative 27 for us because we don't control the war goal. And France is just like going around killing small army stacks for war score. Da, 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 not, much, da, 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 da. not much I can do about it. Yeah, is it that time then? Mm -hmm. we... It is indeed. Right. Well, who was it that brought us in? I've already forgotten. Uh, that was me. So, uh, yeah. So, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, feel free to click the like button. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. And we will see you in the next one. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye. See you soon. Bye.